Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Chant USA: What kids did instead has officials regretting their rule. High school students were majorly caught off guard when they found out that someone at their school didn't want to hear chants of USA. The kids responded in the most amazing way one could imagine. The students were upset and felt like their rights were being violated as Americans when they were told that chanting USA might be considered offensive or intolerant. However, since this is the USA, the students responded and what they did would make any patriotic parent proud. The students pointed out that there are plenty of times where it's appropriate to chant USA and it likely had officials regretting their decision to characterize the patriotic chant as offensive or intolerant. Chanting USA shouldn't be offensive to anyone who is an American citizen, nor should it be considered intolerant because this is America. Instead of responding with anger, the students took it upon themselves to act responsibly and question the statement about the USA chant being offensive or intolerant. The students reminded people that we're all Americans which is why the chant shouldn't be offensive to anyone. The students also reminded officials that one can be patriotic and empathetic at the same time. This got people thinking and then it was later realized that chanting USA really isn't offensive or intolerant at all. It took the peaceful questioning of wise students to raise this awareness to whoever thought it was offensive. Needless to say, there have not been any complaints about the chants at the particular high school. Trending, priceless. Obama's presidential library goes down in flames after what they found hidden in it. Although local news tried to get a face-to-face -face interview with the school's principal she would only answer questions via phone where she stated that the school can officially ban the chant but she still hopes that students will choose not to say it. It should be acceptable for Americans to chant USA – right? Here is more via CBS Local, controversy erupts at Vista del Lago High School in Folsom over students chanting USA. It's a popular way to for students to show pride during sporting events and rallies, but school and district officials are now warning students that the chants could appear inappropriate and intolerant. I wasn't angry, but I was definitely like, why can't we chant USA? Said senior Ryan Bernal, to say USA, you know, we're all the same. We're all American. It doesn't matter what your skin tone is or where you're from. The chants are now causing chatter campus-wide after school staff brought up the topic to a leadership class. Folsom Cordova Unified Communications Director Daniel Figbent said, to practice empathy, to practice kindness and to practice patriotism. You can do both. Advertisement, story continues below. At some schools across the country, the chants appeared to be used in derogatory ways toward opponents of different ethnicities. The California Interscholastic Federation, CIF, which oversees high school athletics, addressed the concerns with local districts. There's a time and a place to yell that and cheer that, said CIFSAC Joaquin Section Commissioner Mike Garrison. The school's principal sent out an email to families Wednesday and relayed the same message to students over the school's PA system, clarifying any confusion. She told students and parents that sometimes we can communicate an unintended message. She also said USA chanting is welcome, but it may be best to do it at what she says are appropriate times, like following the national anthem or the Pledge of Allegiance. School officials worry the chants could come across as intolerant and offensive to some, but parents see it differently, as an expression of pride and acceptance. Mother Natalie Woodbury said, I wanted to chant USA because I want us to pull together and help, not because I want anybody to feel left out or not a part of our country. District officials say they wanted to make clear that there is no ban on chanting USA. I'm glad that they will still allow our students to cheer for our country, said Mother Cody Santero. It's a chant Bernal says will continue to be about uniting, not dividing. We're all one. We all stand as one together, she said. The district says there has never been a complaint about USA chants at the school. Students say there's likely to be a lot of chanting at this Friday's football game, where the theme is USA Pride. This is a great story about students who handled a potential situation with maturity. The students wish to be patriotic and their freedom was almost violated by school officials with questionable motives. Thankfully the students handled it gracefully and with pure American patriotism. For that, the students should be commended on their ability to love their country while offering respect to others as well. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.